okay what is up you guys and welcome back to my channel i know you guys are probably thinking like she wore the same outfit like in her last video i sure did because i am a full-time mom and i have no time i mean absolute no time this is the only time because my mom is watching my son thank you lord today i want to show you guys in this video some haul that i got at morphe and ulta and also at tj maxx you guys already know um i really want to do a series on my channel like filming stuff at tj maxx because i watched like five girls literally from the mainland who does tj maxx videos and their videos are doing great like great so i kind of want to do a hawaii edition you know for my hawaii subscribers so yeah um but let me know if you guys want me to do that let me know down in the bottom bar below because i really want to do it but i'm just scared of filming because people over there are just kind of like looks at you funny like how's this girl talking to herself with a camera you know so i don't know yet but let me just show you guys what i got so if you guys want to see what i got then please keep on watching Okay, so I forgot to mention um, this brand called InStylish. They reached out to me on Instagram and saw my beauty page and wanted me to view their products. So they gave me like a whole bunch of stuff. I'm so excited. Um, they're known for their beauty blenders. They have like the micro um, sponge ones where like they're the velvet ones and then they have their own beauty blender. So let me just show you guys what they got. So they sent me this. So this is basically the multifunctional makeup sponge. So they gave me three sponges and it has like a sponge holder, a heart, and it's gold. I thought this was super cute. So I'm going to do a review on these sponges if they're just as good as like the Beauty Blenders or the Real Techniques Miracle Sponge. So and they also gave me two more. Like I have a total of five sponges from them that is awesome and then they also gave me like a brush set um there's four brushes in here so i thought that was really really cool so i'm probably gonna do um yeah just a basic a product review on their brushes and their sponges so thank you and shout out to in stylish for sending me these so in stylish also gave me this brush i don't know if you guys can see it it's like a stipple brush um or like a blending your concealer or your foundation blush so i want to give this a try so yeah so thank you so much in stylish for these i'm so excited and then i wanted to mention um this sephora mask so it's basically a hemp mousse mask my friend darcy gave this to me she goes you gotta try this out and i was like why did she give me a weed mask like what she goes you gotta try it out because it like really makes your face really nice and soothing and a cooling sensation which you love sheree so she thought about me and she was like you gotta try it out so and we shall see if it just gives me a cooling sensation yeah anyways um let me show you guys what i got at tj maxx so tj maxx i got this limited edition miracle complexion sponge you guys know i love this guy this guy usually comes in orange they have a whole bunch of pack or like a six pack or a four pack of tj maxx for like 12 dollars or you can even get at the clearance area for like 10 dollars but i got this one this one was three dollars so i thought this was really really cool i like the color of it like this neon green and then i also got this elf plus Gl glow golden highlighter and it basically looks like this and it's a really really pretty highlighter the reason why i got this is because this is like really travel friendly which you guys know i love and i love the packaging so it looks like this this is what it looks like um it is gorgeous let me just watch this it's a really really nice shimmer don't mind my eczema you guys it's so so bad there it is right there it's really really light but i like it just to you know travel friendly and i don't like how it's just like so beanie so just really really nice for like morning routines and all that so this is a really nice highlighter and i really really like it the Too faced chocolate gold soleil um bronzer and this is 4.99 at tj maxx and look at the packaging it's so cute and this is a travel size you guys it smells like any of like Too faced bronzers 
It smells like chocolate. It smells so good. Becca's Aqua Luminous Perfecting Concealer in Beige. And this was $5.99. It looks just like that. I really have heard really good reviews about it. So I wanted to get it. And I was shocked that Becca is at TJ Maxx. And then I also got the Anastasia Liquid Lipsticks, which I love in Rock Sand. Um, I don't own this color. And I saw it and I was like, I need it. You guys know I love my nudes. So, of course, I had to get another nude in my collection. And then time for Morphe. Oh my god, you guys know I went crazy. You guys saw my whole rant about Morphe's in Hawaii. And it is super exciting. And I just went back because I really wanted the P. Louise base number two. This is like the popular shade. They have zero, which is like pure white. One all the way up to ten. And they said two is like the best shade for like covering any imperfections or correcting tones so i have zero but then um i wanted to just for like a blank canvas and i believe these are 15 dollars each i think i'm not too sure but yeah they're really really good and then i also got these two lip liners i got it in love bite and sweet tea i love morphe's lip liners and you guys they're only four dollars so Go get you guys Morphe lip liners. Don't get MAC. Don't get any other else's lip liners but Morphe. And they have such a wide array of colors. And you can't go wrong. Like any shade they have, they have it. Like whatever shade you like, they have it. And it's like perfect. $4, you can't go wrong. So I got in these two shades. I follow like these two makeup gurus and they like swear by these shades. So I figured to give it a try. And yeah, so the one I have right now... It's called Bite Me. This is the lip liner from Morphe. And inside I just have the Anastasia Staunch Matte Lipstick in the middle. So yeah, um, these might be too light for me because these girls are like super pale white. But I don't know, I just really liked how it looked on their lips. So maybe I can just use this by itself. I don't know, we'll see. So yeah, I got it in Love Bite and Sweet Tea the rose bay seven piece brush collection this like was on sale for like a one day sale and it was like 15 dollars 12 or 15 dollars for this collection and there is a total of eight brushes in here and i like the packaging and it's like perfect for travel like i am obsessed let me just open it <gasps> i don't want to I just love their packaging and I just hate that I have to like bust it open but I want to show you guys and I love like look how cute is this case wait how do I open this oh my god so here it is oh my god they're so cute look at that one two three four five six seven eight yeah eight brushes you guys this is perfect for travel I'm telling you I'm like obsessed with travel stuff as you can tell like are you serious like this is like the cutest thing ever and i just can't wait to bring these on when i travel and then last but not least ulta is the deal i actually got for my birthday a 75 dollars gift card for my best friend jessica she gave me an e-gift card which is so cute um so i went the next day online and i spent the whole 75 dollars and this is just what I got because I am crazy obsessed like Real Techniques Miracle Complexion Sponge plus the traveling case. I believe I showed this to you guys like a long time ago. I needed a backup because my other one is breaking. So this is perfect for travel. You guys travel stuff is like the best. It's the small things that matter you guys for me, especially for me. And I just love it because you know when you have a beauty blender in your case and it just gets everywhere in your makeup case. I don't like that and it's dirty. So it's good that they have this like case. So it doesn't get everywhere. Does that make sense? Yeah. Okay, next. And then I got this duo two-in-one brush on strip lash adhesive. And this is like the black, the white clear, and the dark tone. So this basically is the white tone on white one side and then the black on the other side. This is perfect, you guys, for travel. Let me show you. Look at this. This is the cutest thing ever. Oh my god. I think this is like six dollars and I am totally gonna put this in my travel lash kit. I'm telling you guys, I like shop for travel stuff. 
but it's crazy because it's not like I'm gonna travel anytime soon because I have a baby. Like what? I don't know. I'm crazy like that. Anyways, I also got the Juvia's Place. I am Magic Concealer, and I got it in the shade number 20, I believe. Yeah. But see, I hate doing swatches online because you can you don't you don't know, but look how light that looks but i think this is like a nice banana shade i'm not too sure but look how big this thing is this is the biggest concealer i've ever seen like this compared to the tarte this will last you forever like seriously and i love concealers you guys obsessed with them love them i want to try every good best-selling concealer whether it's high-end or low-end and then here i got the catrice prime and fine multi talent fixing spray her this stuff is really good and look again travel friendly you guys look how cute and tiny this is this is almost two ounces too cute and then i also got the catrice prime and fine makeup transformation drops waterproof so this basically makes your makeup waterproof it's a primer and so i want to try this out and see if this is like legit because there was really good reviews on it and lots of stars so wanted to give that a try and then i also got the milani matte satin a more satin matte lip cream in the shade number eight indulge and it's a really nice like i don't know how to explain it let me just show you look at that it's just a beautiful like i don't know like what do you guys mauve dark mauve red i don't know it, it's just beautiful and i love it nyx born to glow natural radiant foundation in the shade 21 oh sorry 12.7 natural tan and i've heard so much good reviews about this product you guys so i wanted to give this a try and of course look how tiny travel friendly right travel friendly and then here i just have the ulta beauty brow gel and then in the color clear and this stuff is so good this literally makes your brows set i have it on right now this is a newer packaging the one i have right now is the gray packaging which is the old one so i saw that they restocked and you guys all these products are like four stars and higher i never buy things that are lower and these were on sale so i had to like cop them especially with my 75 dollars plus i got 40 percent off with everything like what i think this was like the early black friday sale that i was that i jumped on and then here i have the essence eye blender brush looks just like that i just needed two dollars to spend more on my cart so i just got this brush because it was like dollar 99 so it's just like an eye blender brush as you guys can see there and then here i have the ofra banana powder press powder and there's a lot of reviews on this it's just like that it's so cute and small again travel friendly you guys know i'm obsessed i'm obsessed and this was like six dollars on ulta's page so i was like why is it on sale like you know is it good but i've heard really good reviews about it so i'm super excited like to try these out and then here i have the thayer's facial mist witch hazel and cucumber and i really like the toners this one is the unscented one so here i have the facial mist i've never tried it but i heard really good reviews you can get these toners right now they also sell these at tj maxx so be on the lookout for that for super cheap these are also at like down to earth and also target here i have the smoothing under eye mask with vitamin c and chamomile and it looks just like that i just need more under eye mask because i need more and here is the catrice prime and fine mattifying powder waterproof transparent i heard nothing but good reviews on this this is like the best powder for when you're out and you want to like blot your face this has no color in it and it literally makes your face super matte which i love so good reviews about it the main thing why i wanted to order from ults is because the catrice line i heard is bomb so i wanted to give it a try that's why majority of the things i have on here are from catrice so that's why I want to give this a try. And then last but not least, I have the Essence Lash and Brow Gel Mascara Style and Comb. This is a really also another good um, dupe for the Ulta Beauty one. And this literally stays in place. Bretman Rock raves about this. He uses this on his lashes because he does get lash lifts. He said this is like the only clear mascara that stays for like longevity. So I actually been trying this way before he even announced it and i love it so i needed a backup and it was crazy that it was on sale and i was like of course i'm gonna buy it 
So that was my haul, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'm sorry if it was super long. Please give it a thumbs up, subscribe before you leave. Hit on the notification bell button if you guys want to see more of my new updated videos. And with that being said, don't forget to like, share, comment down below on any videos that you want me to do. And I'll see you guys in my next, okay? Bye!